guys, and welcome back to the Family Fudge. Today, Mackenzie and I are headed to Target to check out all the fun, cute things for Halloween. So come along with us. Now, I actually came to this Target a few days ago, and they didn't have any Halloween stuff. So when Mackenzie and I went this morning, we were super excited to find that they put it all out. Check out these guys. They look cute. Now, these guys are metal, and it's basically a luminary with a light built in already. Super cute. And check out these fancy pumpkins. This one's black with sequins all over the top, but what do you think it looks like, Mackenzie? Like slime went over it like slime. I like the classic jack-o'-lantern one. These are each three dollars. There's also a black one with a stripe that looks very trendy and there's also this white one with the black polka dots that also looks really cool. Lots of different choices here. There's a black one with glitter, this white one that says boo. I think that's so cute. And then back here this one says home sweet haunted home. Ooh, pumpkin decorating. I love decorating pumpkins. These are really cool. It's like a metallic transfer. It looks easy too. Now here's another decoration with a built-in light, but this one is a witch hat. There's a metal colored one and there's also a black one. I think that's really cool. The light's already built in. And speaking of lights, there's this really cool light-up pumpkin. It looks kind of like a neon sign. Then I feel like the rest of this section is kind of just a hodgepodge. There's a little bit of this and a little bit of that. I think these spooky birds are really fun. Don't you think, Kenzie? Yeah. Now I think they actually had some of these last year, and I think I bought this one that says tricks. They also had treats and spooky and eek. I think they're really cute. I also remember these pumpkins from last year. They look like they're bean bags on them. Yeah, they're really soft on the bottom and they have like a gold top. Pretty interesting. But I'm more interested in these really cute bowls. They're $3 each and I can really see making some fun Halloween goodies in these bowls. They are so cute. I especially love the ghost one. Now these little craft kits are very interesting. Yeah, these are only about $3 each and there's different styles, but you could make a garland, there's also stickers and little felt shapes. We do a lot of different projects with these. I know Lily would love these. And check out this cake stand. There's an orange one and a black. This bag would be perfect for trick or treating. Hey Kenzie, did you see these cauldrons? Yeah. These are really cute. They make me think of Harry Potter for sure. I definitely want to make a Harry Potter themed lunch um, closer to Halloween. I think that's going to be so awesome. Because we're huge Harry Potter fans, right? Yeah. But this cauldron would make a cute candy dish, I think. If you need a witch hat, come get them here. These huge placemats are really cute. There's a pumpkin one and a bat one. Mom, it's not a bat, it's a spider web. Oh yeah, it's a spider web. Now here's a good idea. These are flashing light pendants and you get two for three dollars. These would be perfect for clipping onto your kids when they go trick-or-treating so that cars can see them. That's a good idea. Kenzie, check out the costume sets. Those are cool. They have all different kinds of animals. Now these are really cool if you want to make up your own costume on a budget. There's a cat, a dog, a bunny one. Which one's your favorite? My favorite is the cheetah. The cheetah? Is that a cheetah? I'm not sure. Now one thing that we love to find in this area are the little art kits. For Halloween they have different houses and cats and pumpkins, skeletons. Frankenstein, lots of different choices. We have some really cute ones for Christmas too. I'm looking forward to those. Hey Kenzie, do you want to make a bank? Yeah. This one's a little ceramic bank. There's a skull and a ghost. That's interesting. We found even more bags perfect for trick-or-treating. I love the pumpkin one and this one you get to color yourself. It comes with the markers and everything. These little metal buckets are so cute. They have lots of different designs and these are even decorated on the inside this year as well. They're just a dollar and you could do so many things with these. You could put little treats in there and give them to your friends or maybe use it as a pencil holder on your desk. It'd be super cute. Candy corns inside. How cute! Yeah, that is really cute for just a dollar. They also have lots of different napkins. I'm gonna pick some of those up for lunch videos. And little brooms, like for a witch. These are three dollars. And check out this cool tray. This makes me think of the movie Coco. We really should get these paint your own puzzles. 
Jackson and Lily would love these. Yeah, I definitely stock up on projects like this for just a dollar. Look at the socks, Kenzie. Ooh, they look cute. They have adult socks and kid socks. Look at the pizza ones. Mm -hmm. That's awesome for just a dollar. Here are those witch hats we found earlier. There's a purple one and a sort of green one. I love these little DIY costume kits. There's a shark one and a princess one, and they're only $3. There's also a little mermaid one, <laughs> so cute. They also have capes if you want to be a superhero. And this little poppy headband. We found slime. These are slime favors, so if you want to give out slime instead of candy for Halloween, you can totally do that. Now earlier we found the pumpkin light. They also have a ghost and a bat. Ooh, pillows! These are really cute. There are so many different ones. There's a little pumpkin face. This one's a spider with a cute little bow tie. There's also this skull face and the cat. That's definitely my favorite one. And speaking of cats, there's another one. I think these are to hold a little tea light. There's the cat one and the witch one. I remember last year they had a pumpkin one as well, but I'm not seeing that today. Here's something I've been wanting to try for a very long time. Hair chalk. Yeah, that would be interesting to try. Now, in case you're looking for an inflatable wig, Target definitely has them in several different choices. There's a bat one. This one's supposed to be a... Uh, Fire flames. Fi oh yeah, maybe it's flames. I'm pretty sure Lily would love this Vampirina notebook. These would be fun, Mom. Make your own masks. Yeah, I see there's a pumpkin one, a kitty cat one, a little witch one, and they're just a dollar. Now speaking of masks, they also have these ones. These would be perfect for making your own costume as well. There's Spider-Man and a Stormtrooper. There's Darth Vader. There's a Kylo Ren one and an Iron Man. Okay, Kenzie, what do you think about the spooky tree? Those look weird. I think it looks like Disneyland. I kind of like it. And I would like to get these little pumpkin garlands to hang on there. What did you find, Kenzie? Halloween nail polish. Kenzie, it's actually glow-in-the-dark nail polish. Ooh, that's cool. You get lots of different colors. These would be fun to try. They also had some nail stickers and some rhinestones. These are adorable. And speaking of adorable, check out these Halloween band-aids. Let me know in the comments down below if you love these little squishy toys as much as I do. I think they're so fun. They're just a dollar, and some of them even light up. And now on to the home decor. There are so many cute signs right now and they're double sided. It says one thing on one side and if you flip it around, it says something else. Check this out, Kenzie. These are trick or treat buckets and they're kind of like a felt material. They're really nice and sturdy. Which one do you like the best? I would pick the striped one. Yeah, that one's my favorite too. Now around the corner from that area, I did find these towels, those little kitchen towels in sort of this blue color, and also these pumpkins. So not everything is orange and black and purple. There's some more farmhouse style decor as well. Now I'm always a big fan of cookie cutters. These would be perfect for making lunches, some fall themed lunches. And I think these pie plates are really cute. This is a different design than they had last year. Okay, Kenzie, here's another cute project for kids. This is a string art stand. It looks pretty easy. There's a witch one and a bat one and a little uh, spider one. That's everything in the dollar section, but we wanted to check out what other Halloween stuff they have. You can tell where we got this dress. They also had lots of other Halloween shirts. And they also have lots of pumpkin spiced goodies already, like these pumpkin cheesecake cookies and these Milano cookies. But they did not have pumpkin spice goldfish. That would be weird. Kenzie, let's walk around and see what other kind of Halloween stuff we can find. I think that this jewelry is really cute. There's a pumpkin and a spider and some cat earrings. I really like this kind of stuff for Halloween. These aren't Halloween, but they are cool. Yeah, I can't believe they're bringing back the caboodle, because I used to have one of these. I wish I had saved it for you, Kenzie, sorry. I donated it long ago. So in this back section is where they normally put the Halloween stuff, and I'm not seeing it yet. It might be a little too early. But they did have a lot of Halloween-themed treats already, so if you want to throw some of these into lunches or start baking Halloween treats, you totally can. 
We love these pretzels and these cheese balls. Those are even really tasty. They also had chewy bars and money buddies. Lots of snacks for Halloween. And I found a group pet candy. And for you moms out there, they also had the special holiday scented Mrs. Meyers cleaner, the apple cider, and the pumpkin. Thanks for shopping with us today. Let us know in the comments down below if you're super excited for Halloween too. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next, next time. time.